Trading in commodities a subject to market risk. Read the detailed disclaimer carefully available on the screen. Good morning viewers. Hope you all are doing well today. In today's video session, I will speak about the recent updates in wheat market both in global and domestic markets. So to begin with the prices overview, wheat prices in Indore traded higher by 1.2% from the previous day at Rs 2159 per quintal. In the last 15 days, we have seen that Indore wheat prices has been trading in the range of 2140 to 2300 per quintal. Wheat prices traded lower by around 1.56% from the previous day. And in the last 15 days, we have seen that wheat prices have been trading in the range of Rs. 2250 to 2400 per quintal. In the international market, Seawatt wheat May future is trading lower by 0.47% at 1100 US cents per bushel. Now let's move on to the recent updates on the wheat market. In a recent move, Madhya Pradesh state government had decided to remove the Mandi tax on the exports of wheat which is produced in MP and traders will be allowed to purchase wheat anywhere in Madhya Pradesh on a single license and exporters can buy wheat from the Mandis or from farmers directly. Even the railway board has assured to provide racks for wheat export and this move would certainly increase the wheat exports from India and on the other side uh, if wheat exports increases from MP there would be a significant drop in the wheat procurement from Madhya Pradesh which we need to watch out as and when the procurement starts in most parts of the country wheat procurement would start from April 1st onwards and we need to watch out the procurement progress of the government. Highland Pin Millers Association has booked 70,000 metric tons of Indian wheat for May shipment at a CIF price of 369 USD per ton. Offers for Indian 11.5% wheat were around 335 to 340 USD per metric ton in the western coast ports while Australian feed wheat price is around 370 US dollars per ton for price. In the previous day, Bangladesh released a tender for importing 50,000 tons of wheat uh, which is to be delivered like around 60% in the Chattagram port and 40% in Mongla port. And the tender is set to close on April 4th. And we expect this wheat shipment would be done by India. In the international market, US weekly wheat net sales were 7% higher from the previous week but it is down by 51% from the prior four week average for the week ending March 17 and the data is out today evening. Accumulated wheat exports stands at 15.15 million metric tons and it is 22% lower from the previous year. Wheat export commitment from the US reached 18.89 million metric tons and it is 24% lower from the previous year. Meanwhile, the wheat exports commitment reached 86.7% of the USDA forecast for 21-22. To conclude with the prices outlook, domestic wheat prices in indoor market would trade sideways to down as long as the prices are trading below the trend reversal point of 22,046 rupees per quintal. In the international market, seaboard prices would trade sideways to down as long as the prices are trading below the trend reversal point of 1304 US cents per bushel. However, the downside risk in prices is very limited because of the global tightness of wheat and 
in the indian prices also the downside risk is limited and for the medium to longer term the price outlook remains to be firm because the indian wheat export demand would increase significantly from the previous year thanks for watching have a nice day thank you for watching our video hope you liked it please do like and subscribe our channel for more insights on commodities details are given on the screen thank you very much